First of all, thank you for your time, Karen. Um, tough night for you guys. How can you explain this? What happened tonight here? Uh, it's hard to say. It's disappointing. You know, we I think we put together a good 44 minutes and then kind of just lost our way after that. We we knew we needed to start the second half on the front foot and. I, I think we just kind of lost our game plan and, and things kind of got out of hand and it was too little too late. You just mentioned 44 minutes were, went perfectly to nothing at that point. Then you guys gave up that uh, penalty kick in the, I, I guess in the 45th minute. Yeah. What went through your mind when that happened? I mean, knowing that uh, halftime was coming up, mm -hmm. that uh, you guys are giving up that penalty kick, what went through your mind at that time? I, I mean, it's a tough goal to give up. You, you, you never want to do that, but still, you know, we're, we're in a good position going into half and, you know, it's really in our own hands. You know, we control our own destiny and um, we failed. You know, we, we, we didn't do what we needed to do to get a result. Were you guys surprised? Because there were 10 minutes in which you guys gave up three goals from the 78th minute to the 80th minute. What happened in those 10 minutes in, in which you guys gave up those three goals? Because the game was tight at the, yeah. at the time. I, I, I think we lost our composure. You know, we, we needed to settle down, you know, um, and just kind of find a rhythm again and bounce back. And we just we weren't able to do that. So what's the key for next, next week, next game? What do you guys need to improve upon other than... We, we need, keeping the composure. <laughs> we, we need to build off of these mistakes and um, we need to eliminate them going into next week. We, need, we, know, we know that we have the, the talent all around to, to be successful. We just need to put together the full product for 90 plus minutes. I mean, you guys have, you have a target on your back because you guys made it to the finals last, last season. Mm -hmm. So you guys, I mean, everybody knows that, that you guys can do much better than what you guys did tonight. Yeah. So, so going forward, this, this, this is a long season, so going forward, what's, what's the team mentality? Uh, we, we just got to stay positive and stay together. You know, we, you're never strong if you're divided. And, mm -hmm. and although it was a tough mm -hmm. one tonight, I think there's a lot of learning opportunities that we can take from it. And like you said, it's a long season, mm -hmm. and I have full confidence that we'll, we'll get it right. What's the message to all the fans that came out to support you guys? And the guy, the guy, they stayed till the very yeah. last minute hey, hey, for we, you. We always appreciate their support. You know, they're, they're our 12th man, you know, and we need them. and. It wasn't good enough for, for them tonight, and um, we'll, we'll do better. So I know it's a tough night, it's a tough loss. However, at the very last minute of the game, uh, Giovanni gave us a beautiful goal. Can you just talk a little bit about that goal? I mean, yeah. it's kind of like uh, the positive out of, out of a tough night, but this, that was a beautiful goal that he scored. Yeah, it was a great goal. I mean, yeah. right right up, upper bin, upper 90, you know, it's, but like I said before, a little bit too little, too late, you know, I mean, we, we, we love to see our guys getting on the score sheet, but um, at the end of the day, it's a team game, and the team, the team was unsuccessful. All right. Thank you very much.